where do you want to be in the future? I'm not talking about next week or next month. I'm talking about many years down the line. As a web designer, it's easy to focus on the now, you know, projects coming in, deadlines and all of that. It's easy to just look at today and get through today. But when it comes to web design, especially how it's constantly changing in terms of trends, tools and technology, we need to start thinking ahead because if you don't think ahead, and you just focus on what you do now, you could get stuck. So here's a little bit of advice for you. Start looking at your portfolio that you currently have. Are you proud of it? Are you happy with how it looks and what it portrays and says about you? Is it looking a little bit outdated? What about the tools that you rely upon? Are they going to last in the long term or will they eventually become obsolete tomorrow? If you only think in the moment, you're always playing catch up with the latest new tools and trends. And when you realize that you need to catch up to it, it may be too late and people are way ahead of you in terms of competition. So you need to start thinking long term. What do you want your career to be like? Do you always want to be a freelancer? Do you want to have an agency? Do you want to specialize in a niche? Do you want to start doing appointment booking websites? Don't wait. Get on with it. Ask yourself what skills you need to get there. What do you need to learn? Is it a little bit of coding? Is it mentoring? Is it shadowing or working with an agency or just experimenting? Don't wait, get on with it. If you wanna learn more about user experience, SEO, web accessibility, maybe it's building like a passive income stream, maybe it's YouTubing, whatever it is, plan for it now. I keep saying it, don't wait. Thinking ahead isn't about ignoring the present. It's about setting a direction, a goal that you're going to aim for. Because if you don't, you're just going to end up drifting in an ocean somewhere in the world. And here's the hard truth. If you're not growing, you're falling behind. The industry won't wait for you to catch up. The world is always revolving, moving. You need to move with it. Think about your finances. Think about your skills. Web design income can be very unpredictable. Clients disappear. Projects are delayed projects never happen. Seriously, I don't want anyone here to find themselves out of pocket because they were not planning for the future. Build a safety net. Save your money and your income for when you have a dry month. Invest in tools and skills that are going to keep you relevant. Now, I don't want you to overstress yourself out about every little detail, right? You can't be the king of everything, okay? But you got to start thinking about what you need to do to be stable and still grow at the same time. So don't just think about where you are now. Think about where you want to be in five years time. Do you want to feel stuck or do you want to feel proud of what you've built? So take some time to map it out. Your future is shaped by what you do today. Plan it, work for it and make sure you're ready for what's coming next. <laughs>